Hey guys, let's see, bringing you another video. Welcome back to uh, a new recording session. New day, new recording session. Playing Zerath. Feel free to pause it because I can't dilly dally. There's two duos uh, Smurfs, not Smurfs. So you could say enemy team may have advantage because their Smurf duo is Smurfs. I feel I said Smurf one too many times then. We're against an Oriana. Do, 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 oh, do, I say smurfing smurf? Maybe. Ah. So I will just mention, um, I have a, an idea that I might do. The new 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 game just came out. Some people may have been playing it already. Uh, Riot very kindly gave it to me for free, um, which is awesome. I want to play this game. You know, I haven't played so many of the other Riot games and I'm always given them. Um, but I actually am thinking I want to play it. And I might stream it, but I might record it and I might upload it on YouTube. And I might do a bit of a mad thing. And, you know, I know obviously my main thing is just League of Legends. But what I'm thinking is if, say, I do a stream of it over the next few days, I've heard through the grapevine it's an 8 to 10 hour game. I think I could realistically do that in about 3 three streams what i'm thinking let's say each one is three hours long of me playing it i genuinely just might upload three hour videos as the second video a day for a few times and i, I might just do it to the huzzy account not even huzzy extra so let me know what you think of that um because yeah i'm i'm tempted to do that because you know you don't have to watch the whole three hours in one go. Um, obviously, you can pace yourself. Or if you just wanted to have it in the background for three hours, that's fine too. Let me know what you think, YouTube plebs. If, or again, I, I don't know if it would be a good idea of like breaking it all up into half an hour to an hour sessions. Because then that's so much more videos instead of League of Legends videos. That's the, the thing. Yeah, before content became my full-time job, um, and, you know, I had to, like, let's say, focus up a little bit more, I did have, you could say, a little bit more fun in uploading anything. Like, I used to have a series, and we didn't do many episodes, but it was called Huzzy One Shot, and I just played a game once for a video and uploaded it. And, yeah, they were called Huzzy One Shots. People did quite enjoy them. Oh, that was really bad. Why are you roaming? Double summoners of Leona used. And you've got a Draven in your lane who needs kills. Like, bro, Leona, that's kind of trolling. Hey, look, Draven's dead. Like, hello? <laughs> Kill the Leona, she's got no flash! Yeah, she's dead. What are they doing? Well, that's stupid by the Leona. Hey, Diablo Ray, five months of Prime. Thank you so much, my dude. So obviously it does screw me a bit in mid lane because it makes me have no mana, no health. So I have to be stupidly careful now, which is annoying. Oh my God, Hecarim was just waiting in a bush. At least I don't die. He literally was just waiting in that bush, man. Oh, give me a, give me an assist. That red buff, red buff, red buff. Okay, I don't mind no death. Damn, she didn't die. She might have he, like either the red buff didn't kill her, or she got her e off to give her some shielding. Okay. At least Graves is uh, helping. Like, that's the one thing I'll say. Normally when I'm getting ganked by a Leona and a Hecarim's mid and all that, normally I'm doing it alone. But hell, we got an actual jungler, which is lovely. Yeah, she had 7 HP. What? Use TP. Jack's just got a solo kill on a lane that in theory purely counters him. Interesting.
So I'm playing Xerath because I used to play a lot of Xerath. Xerath, I think, is quite good into Orianna eventually. Because basically, when you're in mid to late game as a Xerath, you just annihilate things from such high range, and Orianna, in theory, can't really get to you. At least very easily. But until I get probably... Am I going Ludens or... No, I'm probably going Leandri this game, probably, right? Oh, I didn't expect that to die. Um, hey, Mika. So yeah, until I get my actual mythic item, I'm probably going to have some mana issues for sure. Did she go back instantly? Yeah, that's weird. Yeah, you and me. Right on a star. And I will say, if you're on the YouTube audience right now, pause what you're doing. You're watching the video. Don't pause the video. Quickly go out of full screen, scroll down a little bit, and throw a like on the video. It does help out. Thank you very much. I could have died. Very nice. Very good. Very nice. And Hecarims are always so goddamn squishy. Again, I don't, I've, I've said it many, many times. I'm looking forward to a patch or a time of league that Hecarim just isn't OP. That would be lovely. Because he's been OP for so long. Yeah, I'm on my way. Was this Zora? Because I didn't really check much of the op.gg not by pg poor professor was this oriana an oriana player why are you diving a malfight i don't think he knows i don't know why you do that Malphite, the thing that has crazy CC, attack speed slow. Like, yeah. That uh, was a weird dive attempt. If I knew where he was, I could go for an ult. I've had take that in my head for weeks now. And again, most people watching, the vast majority of my audience is Americans. They'll have no idea what I'm probably singing, because take that never made it properly into America. <clears throat> I am thinking, do I go Leandri or do I go Ludens? Because like Ludens will give me higher kill pressure on Draven, higher kill pressure on Orianna. Higher kill pressure on Hecarim. It's not my job to kill Malphite. It's not really my job to kill Leona. That'll more be Kaiser's job. So maybe I actually go Leondry. Hmm. Oh my god, that didn't do enough damage. Hey! <laughs> I also might do a coffee order today, ladies and gentlemen. And a, a special shout out during the YouTube live stream that we did. I didn't. I, obviously, it's not going to be the standard, but Jesus Christ, people went mad. We got like over fifty dollars or fifty pounds worth of super chats. Like it was absolutely mental. Gravesol? No, he doesn't have it. He used it already. <clears throat> and a few people who are doing those donos are like, oh, Huzz, you're next. It, Halloween's over, god dang it. I'll be honest, I was playing some games on Halloween evening on stream and I didn't know those were a thing. Oh, they freaked me out that. I thought it was in the game.
<coughs> Gotta be careful. She doesn't have ult up, but her ult cooldown. I think her cooldown is less than mine. I don't know why, I'm just getting a feeling of Leona's gonna be here soon. <laughs> nice. Very good, very nice, very good, very nice. There's a control ward in here. Just wanna push this up so if something happens around Rift Herald, the lane at least is hitting their tower. God, I don't like Hecarim. <laughs> Again, I, hilariously, I don't mind the champion. It's just the fact that he's been in such a strong place for such a long time. It's just kind of annoying. And it's like, oh, let other things be in the in the limelight for a bit. You know? He's just been such a default strong champion for so long. I also will say I'm noticing more Renatas. I played Renata a few days ago and it didn't seem that bad. So I don't know if the owner is, uh, sorry, Renata is making a comeback. But that's pretty cool if she is. I don't have anyone nearby. I don't know if I should have opened with ultimate there or not. Nice. We can kill him. Nice. Into dragon. Let's go. Big. Oh. We need Graves to come here. I wouldn't even finish the tower right now. Wait, Graves? This guy's trolling. He's just not coming to the dragon! What? Did he not look at the mini-map? At all? The heck? Now that was weird. At least we got it. Hey, Zovo for show! Do you and me, we can ride on a star. Ale, Ale, Ale. I think Malph yeah, Malphite had to use ultimate to get Jax that low. Otherwise, Jax wouldn't be that. I take it back. Take it back. Do 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 do. Take it back. <laughs> oh no. No. I should probably let Graves have it. Oh my god. He actually had to use Flash for it, though. That probably would have been better if I actually tried to take it, to be honest. Oh. This Orianna loves this ward. This is the second time she's put it in the exact same place. Players do have patterns. Like, a lot. If you notice the patterns players have, a lot of players do the exact same thing every game. You know, not even just, like, within a game. That Orianna will put that ward there every single game. I nearly can guarantee it. That Draven just walked into tower. Jax TP'd. I don't think he needed to do that. There's a ball. It's gone. It means she either was basing back here or she's run away. 
Coda never buys pink wards, oh really? <laughs> A lot of players don't, to be honest. Was it, again, was it the Bowser of FS? Someone said, who a very big stream was like, oh, that doesn't give me damage or something like that. It doesn't give me active stats. Okay, not the worst thing in the world. Damn, he had cleanse. I guess I should have expected it. Bad flash from me as well. Oh, that's annoying. How much did he get? It hasn't told me how much he got for that kill. Hey, Sense Slash. Why hasn't it told me how much he got for that kill? It does that normally, doesn't it? On the enemy team. Hey. He didn't get the tower gold, I don't think. Mm. That was a bad death. Well, no, it's just Draven passive. Of like Draven cashed in X amount on his passive usually. I swear. Hey, Joe Magic. Oh, I should have gone blue trinket. Oops. Oh Jesus. Graves, no, that was bad by Graves. Oh dear. There's Oriana with the exact same ward again. Ah, missed. Okay. Where's Kaiser? Nowhere to be seen. Isa, please, where the hell are you? But Hecarim is so overpowered. What the hell is wrong with that champion? Oh, you are good. Okay, good, Shmion. Okay, we just need a sub then. I don't know if your brother's available. Oh, Bindi Boom can't play because his laptop's not back from repair. God, Hecarim is so obnoxious. And all he had there was a Spear of Shojin and a Serrated Dirt. Uh, Graves. Whoa, okay. Fair enough. Did not truly expect that. They're not on the dragon though. This Hecarim doesn't it, he doesn't prioritize dragons at all. Yeah, I'm gonna risk because Orianna's dead, I can go top lane and push this back because Jax is TP bot. Because even if I try to run there, I'm not probably gonna make it in time for the dragon dying. So <laughs> you will lose. We're one dragon away from soul, though. That's pretty good. Oh, there's a TP there. That must be Malphite. It was Orianna. Right. This Hecarim is so squishy. Uh, Leona's inting. I don't like my positioning here because Hecarim is just going to yeet for me. Mm -hmm. You just see it coming. Oh, Malphite ult. I'm not dead. What? I should be dead. Ooh. Yeah, Hecarim's dumb OP. He's really easy to play. Because all you got to do is charge up a dumb E, and it does... Uh, 
That's bad ult. See? Oh dear. Yeah, let's go get blue if it stays alive by the time. <laughs> Wait. He just took blue from Rosera. 97% mana. Yep. Great. Thanks for taking that. That's great. You're going to make good use of it against the wall of Malphite. Thanks. Gotta one shot the um no oh, Renato went up there. Gotta one shot the Hecarim basically. We can if we just get a stun on him and Graves comes nearby, like we can one shot him. Probably not that hard. This this Leona is so aggressive. Go 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 go. <sighs> this Oriana wants the split push, which is a bit peculiar, but I guess that's the modern day of League of Legends. <laughs> you really mucked that up. Thank you. And you shouldn't be bot lane. It's so stupid that a team fighting Oriana is trying to split push bot lane people are just obsessed with it nowadays they truly truly are okay needed to do that earlier huh? Sorian is so bad. They've got Hecarim and Draven. God damn it. Hey, Ace. Well, it's more the Hecarim than anything else, really. Just, he can just engage freely and just doesn't have any fear because he's got full damage, but then presses W, so he's basically then a full tank. Like, god damn. What the hell's the weakness? Malphite's top. I don't... Does he have TP? I'm kind of convinced he used TP. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. They were just waiting for me. Okay. And that's a Rihanna TP again here, even though she was here. Man! They were just waiting for me. That's annoying. I don't know if my team could do Baron this quick. I get the idea behind it, because, you know, they want to do the dragon it denies us the dragon soul and you can see they are coming over but i don't know if we do it quick enough oh, well, actually i think we do yeah we do i guess graves damage is also really high and fed boom oriana ultimate wasted okay good that's not that bad honestly i will trade my life and dragon they got one we still only need one for baron i think that is actually kind of a worth trade obviously i don't really want to die but that's actually not that bad Oh, I'm so far behind in farm. Because I don't really want to side lane, obviously, as a Zerath. That would be stupid. But now I'm having to compete with farm constantly, which is not good. I'm never going to beat a Kaisa getting farm as a Zerath. You mucked up.
I just can't land one. Oh, I am rusty as their earth, man. Old me would have hit that. Oh, Hecarim is on me face. Kill him, dude. He's so squishy. How did we not get that kill? Boom. Yeah, big. Let's go. Okay. Oh, the Graves Halt just. Hey, Sadox. Am I feeling better? Hey. <laughs> yeah, I'm feeling better. I'm not. I, I've, I've taken my medication again, so I'm not throwing up anymore. But and uh, all, all I'm going to say, I'm not going to get into it right now, but we got some really bad family news yesterday. Um, so, yeah, just going to keep trucking for now. Life sometimes just throws you hurdles. Asia car. Hey, Karuj. Look how tight, like, when Riot was like, oh, we're going to make jungling harder. Like, dude, for a mage to kill a blue buff now by itself is hard. Really hard. Oh yeah, I forgot that the enemy team's duo was Draven Hecarim and they're like both Smurf duos. Were they Smurf one-trick duos? Probably, right? That seems to be the average Smurf duo nowadays. They always one-trick. It's more like, why did I do that? Just to mess with her. It's that simple. Just to mess with her. Sometimes messing with somebody can make them do weird things. I'm going to sell that because I'm not going to... Let's be honest, I'm not getting full stacks of Magi's this game. That's Orianna TP. That's just dead. She missed ult again. God, she just misses ult and ult and ult. That worked out well. Bit Draven. Cool. Dude. That Renata nearly took that blue. <laughs> oh, dude, I'm so close to Death Cat. Please, please, please. No. Oh. Okay, if she buys GA, then I'm okay with it. But if she doesn't, then that would have been better for me. Oriana being alone again. Oriana is obsessed with being alone. If you're obsessed with being a role, be a top laner. Oh. Oh! This Draven base is at such weird places. I think it might be Tilt, to be honest. Like a... There's... Uh... They didn't kill anything. Well, they killed a Renata. So it's like, whoop, whoop. Look at that Hecarim build. Like, am I not mistaken? 
a few patches ago, they were like, oh, we're going to try and get rid of this build of Hecarim, like full, full, full damage. And they wanted him to become basically a bruiser again. That's like assassin. Legit, like assassin Hecarim. And he stills quite tanky because of his W. This is a bit risky because Hecar Hecarim will go for the steal. He won't go for the steal. Eh? Interesting. Dance. Danced. <laughs> I gave up after. <laughs> uh, yeah, my ult is at a minute of roughly cooldown, so it's not that bad. Got him to stay as well. And I actually do quite a lot of damage now. As you can. Yeah, we need to go bot. Oh, let's go get a little bit more damage. Why not? I'm just going to use TP not to waste our time as much. You need to use the Baron. Excuse me. They're all top lane. Bless you. Thank you. Yona's inting again. There, guys, you are literally focusing a Renata support. Good job. Good job. And that? And that? And that? Did I not get the quad? That was less than 10 seconds from my triple kill, no? I'm legendary. Wait, wait, what? Where'd the Draven go? We won! So, definitely a bit rusty on Xerath, but I ended up the game legendary, so I just had to get to the point that I knew I was strong. Like, again, like I said in lane phase, why did I pick Xerath into Orianna? Lane phase can be a bit iffy, but then eventually I'm so far out of range that I just annihilate them from range. And I will say the enemy team focusing a Renata, yeah, that's probably a bit stupid by the enemy team. Um, Leona ultimate used on Renata then, Malphite ult used on Renata then, and I think even Hecarim ult was used. So three of them, maybe even Draven ult as well. Three to four of their big ults were used for a Renata. You ain't gonna win the game when that happens. I'm actually gonna give her the honor too, because I think she played fairly well. So yeah, 23 LP though, very nice. We'll take it. Our goal today is just get out a Diamond 4, I think, because uh, I should not be in Diamond 4. <laughs> I really shouldn't be. Uh, so we do the most damage in the game, 39,000 compared to Orianna's 21. So I'm not too far away from actual double damage. My Kaiser did 15. So we did carry this one quite hard. My absolute damage that I was dealing, and I know a lot of it is poke, but let's be honest, I was missing a lot of my ranged poke with my ultimate. So most of my damage was relevant to a fight. So yeah, that was pretty good. 10-3-7. Um, um, I think... I got legendary. How many is seven kills legendary? Because I think I was three and three at one stage and then I didn't die. And then I've gone 10 and three. But yeah, overall, pretty nice. Happy with that performance. Again, very rusty with Zerif. There's no doubt, but we'll take it. And yeah, that was an Orianna player as well. Um, that was an Orianna. Not main is a fourth most played champion, but that she's got 30 games. Is it eight? It's eight or seven or eight. I can't remember. Wait, so single kill, double kill. That's not a thing triple kill but that doesn't when when are you dominating is that five i genuinely don't know i can't remember but anyway if you got uh, yeah i went on a killing streak after i sold a dark seal yeah i guess that makes sense if you guys enjoyed regardless though pretty good game do throw a like on it throw a comment throw a subscribe and i'll see you guys next time goodbye Call down the reckoning to bring back hope and peace restore our glory Die.
stop regime I know how to unleash eternal 